Hello everyone and welcome to, huh, that's weird. Fix this real quick. Ah, there, that's better. and welcome to Reflection Thursday, where every Thursday we look back the week and we talk about something that happened. Now, I want to apologize because this video technically was supposed to be last week's, but um, work happened and I'm now a full-time employee. Therefore, my hours are heavily skewed in creating YouTube content for you. So, more power that I was able to do, to do three videos this week alone. But this video has been taking me a long time to make because to say what exactly I need to say without really trying to hurt anybody, even though what I'm about to say is gonna hurt a couple people, has been really hard. So, with that being said, let's just get into it. I hate SJWs. Now, okay, if I'm gonna get more specific, let me just say, I, do, I or not hate, but I strongly dislike the SJWs who tell me that I cannot say certain words, that I can't celebrate who I am as a person, or that there are 76 genders. Or if I'm gonna add one more, um, if I am not interested in dating trans people, then I am a bigot. Not kidding, that was actually a video that was made on YouTube. Let's start with trans people. Would you date a trans person, honestly? Think about it for a second. Okay, got your answer? Well, if you said no, I'm sorry, but that's pretty discriminatory. So what bothers me about these particular types of SJWs is that, once again, you know, free country, I think we forget that whole plan that it's free country and that we have the thing called freedom of speech. And what you're doing, my friend, is now trying to smother me away from using my freedom of speech to say whatever I please. Is it going to upset you? Absolutely it's going to upset you. But that is where we as a society have to kind of find a middle ground. Obviously everyone doesn't have the same ideals, which is understandable, but at the same time you have to be able to take those differences and do some amazing things. And to be honest with you, I'm pretty certain a lot of a lot of the social justice warriors that say the, that you cannot do this and the other stuff like that, probably their lives are a little boring and they are nothing special, which is fine. It's fine to not be special. It's okay. It's fine. And they feel like they have to do something crazy and extraordinary and different um, to make themselves known, especially in this digital age where everyone's got a YouTube channel. Everyone wants to be famous. But the problem is, is that even if you have a strong following, I mean, you're well known, but you're not famous. I'm sorry, Whoopi Goldberg is famous. No, honey, I'm famous. You go, girl. But it's these kind of SJWs that really get under my skin because they try to speak like it's as if they have scientific evidence when really science cannot prove many of the things that they say, like, for instance, there are 76 genders. So here's the point of this video. Everyone's gender is different. There are infinitely many genders because no one experiences their gender in the exact same way. That is why I've started the hashtag 76 genders, even though there are probably more like millions of gender. There's no way that that is a thing. That is not a thing. There's no science to back that up. Non-binary ain't a thing. I, I can't even believe I have to say that. It's because there's people on YouTube and just out in the world who think these things and don't have any scientific evidence to back up what they're saying. And in that matter, gets under my skin so much. And this is why I watch people like Blair White, Jeff Holiday, and Andy Worski because they are <laughs> they, they are what we like to call the anti-SJWs because they are trying to set the record straight and I do love watching their content. Do they have some content that I absolutely do not agree with? Yes, but that is okay. That is where conversation comes in. So in conclusion, I hate SJWs. They don't have scientific evidence to prove anything that they say sci about science and they're just really bored with their life. Sorry about that. So let me know in the comments down below, what are your thoughts about SJWs? If if they're right, if they're not right, if what I just said was anything more merited, uh, but please leave those in the comments down below. And if you didn't hear, I'm going to VidCon. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Uh, if you are excited to go to VidCon, please like this video. That would make my heart so happy inside. And thank you so much for watching this week's episode of Reflection Thursday. If you liked the video, please don't forget, like and subscribe down below. I release new videos every Every single Monday and Thursday. All of my social media links, including the link to Return Home, The Way I See It, and my merchandise shop are located in the description down below. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, my name is Forrest. Remember, Pink Cake. <gasps> Woo!